When is the right time to sell stocks and cryptos? A question that lingers in the minds of many new investors. It's a complex puzzle for some, one that involves an understanding of market timing. But fear not, for today we get into this very topic, breaking down the process into simple, digestible steps. First up, it's essential to understand what market timing is. In the world of investments, market timing refers to the strategy of buying or selling financial assets such as stocks and cryptocurrencies based on predictions of future price movements. It's like trying to ride the waves of the market, buying low and selling high. However, timing the market isn't as easy as it sounds. It involves an understanding of economic indicators, market trends and a little bit of research. Nonetheless, it's not impossible for seasoned investors or even beginners who learn. One of the first steps in timing the market is understanding the economic indicators. These are a variety of statistical measurements that reflect the overall health of the economy. They include things like employment rates, inflation levels, and gross domestic product growth. By keeping an eye on these indicators, investors can get a sense of where the market might be headed. Next, it's important to follow market trends. These are patterns or tendencies that occur in the market. Trends can be upward, meaning prices are generally increasing, downward, where prices are declining, or sideways, where prices are relatively stable. Identifying these trends can help investors predict future price movements. It's also worth noting the role of investor sentiment in market timing. Market sentiment refers to the overall attitude of investors toward a particular financial market or asset. When sentiment is positive, prices tend to rise. When it's negative, prices usually fall. Keeping a pulse on market sentiment can provide valuable insights into potential market movements. But even with all this knowledge, timing the market perfectly is nearly impossible. It's a risky strategy that can lead to significant losses if predictions are off. That's why many financial advisors recommend a more conservative approach known as buy and hold. This strategy involves investing in a diverse portfolio of assets and holding onto them for the long term, regardless of market fluctuations. In summary, timing the market involves understanding economic indicators, following market trends, and gauging investor sentiment. It's a complex strategy that requires some understanding of the financial market and a willingness to take on risk but remember, while it's possible to make significant gains through market timing, it's also possible to incur substantial losses. Therefore, it's always wise to seek advice from a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. So when is the right time to sell stocks and cryptos? The answer isn't straightforward. It depends on various factors, including market conditions, economic indicators, investor sentiment, and your personal financial goals. One aspect to keep in mind is staying informed, can help you in making educated decisions. None of this was financial advice. Happy investing from CupidInvest.com. This was not financial advice.